Hello, my name is Walter, and welcome to Trailer Reaction for you. Today, I'm doing Star vs. Forces of Evil, and I know I'm late to the party, and um, I'm always late to the party anyway. Um, my voice is healing. Uh, I really shot off my vocal cords, and I'm not going to do that again anytime soon. Hope you guys understand that. Um, and to to anyone really asking, like, uh, why why aren't I doing like videos and everything? Go go back and watch uh, some of my videos. Like I really explained that. I really told you guys that. And I'm kind of making space so that you guys can watch with me. Uh, I really haven't watched this one yet. Uh, so and I, you know I've heard some stuff about it, and I kind of watch like bits by bits here and there, but not really a full, the full trailer yet. So just just mentioning that so that you guys understand this. Um, I, I really hope that we, we see more stuff like being explained or at least like uncovered because like there's so many things in this series that I really want them to kind of explore more like more about uh, stars like background and maybe more of the the butterflies and you know the the rich history behind their their ro royal patriarchy or matriarchy um, because like there's more meat behind um, Queen Butterfly story. So, uh, yeah, without further ado, let's go. Okay. Wait, is that Star killing. No, taking away Toffee's, like, <laughs> ribbit. Uh, the middle finger. Well, middle finger. Is that Snookers? <laughs> what? Wait. Yeah, this really, really, feels really good right now. Oh man. Yeah, it is. It's uh, Toffee's uh, hand. Hmm. I don't think you can, Star. Yikes. Really? Oh. Wait, why did they shake hands at the end? Well, there's more. Oh, sorry. Whoa. I I just got chills. Like, what? I'm sorry. I I accidentally paused there. Um, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't realize there was more. I thought. I thought it ended. Um, but yeah. Uh, I just saw a lot of things that. That were in this, that was really interesting. Like Toffee, Toffee came back. Like it's not even even Ludo or anything. Like I hope they they kind of explain that. Like, they kind of explore that. Um, Ludo kind of had uh, Toffee's hand. So like that that means the 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 bone and and Ludo like kind of combined. Like Ludo's hand kind of combined and like I wouldn't really know what happened with that. And maybe it kind of has to do with the magic and everything. Um, and uh, apparently Toffee killed um, Queen Butterfly's uh, mother. I I'm not really sure what's her first name, I'm so sorry. Um, and apparently Queen Eclipsa is still alive, so that's going to be a big role to play in the next season. Um, and uh, you know, there's a lot of things that, that happened, it is that I can really talk about, but you know, obviously, some other people have done it, like you know, you see here. But all I'm gonna say is that this, this series is gonna get better and better. And you know, uh, Star is right, you know, I think that she has a legitimate reason to be a little bit angry at this point because I think the 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 mother, the mother is gonna be like, uh, no, we should just like, like recuperate and and think about this through and through. But you know, Star is very much the the person to go in and do it. Like, you know, she doesn't really kind of think uh, in that way. Like, I mean, like it's kind of like in the Kara way where she just you know goes in and fights. Like, I mean, in the season one way. But you know, it makes more sense for Star because you know she's still pretty young and you know she's like just reached her teenage years, so it kind of really makes sense there. And uh, you know, it looks like at some point you know Toffee is I mean Toffee Ludo is gonna be um, like is gonna kind of win because like we saw him kind of like 
chain uh, King Butterfly up, and you know it's, he's played by Alan Tudyk as well, which is just kind of weird because uh, Alan Tudyk is kind of talking to himself. Like I mean, because Alan Tudyk uh, voices Ludo as well. Like that's one of the things I'm like, oh yeah, I I forgot about that. Uh, but yeah, there is gonna be a point where Toffee Ludo kind of kind of wins, like maybe a mini battle or something like that. Um, there's a lot of visual gags in the background which is really cool and you know they're stuck they're upping the ante and they're stepping up the the darker visuals like there were a lot of imageries of like darker plain fields and like mud and like dirt and grid and like frogs like when star went ribbit like I don't know what that was like I mean you know it's, it's silly it, it, it is very much star stars uh, character and personality I have to ask like what what did that you know what, because like some of the the goofiness as well like kind of gets into the story like in some way and a plot as well and if it doesn't I, I don't really care like I don't really mind that um, and I think I think for this show I Definitely, but yeah, I definitely think there is going to be a lot of conflict in this one and in this new episode and uh, I'm really looking forward to it because I, w I want to see what happens next to, to um, Star and uh, Marco's relationship from here on. I know that uh, their friendship is kind of burned like because like Star is like right to be angry with her mother because she technically they burned bridges already with Marco and you know her other friends as well. Uh, I'm pretty sure she kind of assumes that she burned the bridge as well, but I'm sure that they understand that this is all, you know, her magical world, etc. And uh, of course, Marco is not gonna give up on you know his best friend, but um, I really hope we we get to see more of it. And I actually tweeted on Twitter, um, and you can follow me at Red Alon. Uh, that uh, Jackie could be on Ludo's side, and why I think that is because like. Jackie's kind of taking this too coolly and like I, I, I definitely think like even though you know you're a badass and you're cool and stuff like some of the things should kind of set you and go well you know that kind of surprised me a little bit like you know and, and some does it's just that I don't I don't think she's technically on the good side because like we never really see her like get too upset with anything and you know I, I've I think there was only one sequence in which like Jackie was technically in the room when uh, they were doing the whole slumber party thing and uh, there there seems to be the that girl who um, who looks a lot like um, Darren actually uh, a bit like no, no not a lot I'm exaggerating of course but um, and also it kind of reminds me of that you know stereotypical nerdy kind of girl and you know it's more of that like not like not to throw anything under the bus but it's just like you know Nostalgia Critic came up with this um, term called hyperfan girl and it, it kind of reminds me of that so it's like you know Star's biggest fan and it, it kind of makes sense um, so yeah, I, I don't really have much to say. I'm, I'm sure a lot of people have dissected it and you know they've have, you know they've done analysis about it and I'm just here to enjoy things and I hope you are too. Um, I really love this series and uh, I'm hoping to do uh, more on it you know, as it comes back and uh, um, FIFF uh, F is for family has confirmed that they're doing um, season three so I'm really excited about that. I don't know when they're gonna come back though. Uh, but I am following the the writers, and so far they they've said like, oh, you know, we we kind of like your videos, and I'm like, oh, thanks. <laughs> you know, I I never, you know, assume to get like this this kind of recognition. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna get a better camera for sure. Uh, hope you know, I I hope I'm not you know hitting you on the head with that, you know. Uh, but yeah, I'm just finding the time to to kind of buy it, and I'm I'm still within like my exam week, so I really can't do, do anything much. Uh, this is this is as much as I think I can do. Um, I'm pro pro most probably gonna do a Game of Thrones one as well, so uh, just hopefully I I I do that as fast as I can. Um, I I really want to see Toffee back. That that's one of the characters that I I really love from season one, and I was like, ah, oh, I'm so, 
I'm kind of pissed that I don't really get to see him in season two, but I think that was for more for the the, the cracks in the relationship between Star and Marco, um, and that is kind of important as well. And uh, I hope to see more of Ludo as well, kind of like you know Ludo is Ludo as annoying as he can be. You know he is sort of still interesting as a as a character and an, as an antagonist. I think that he. He can be kind of stupid, but also he understands that power is something to be wielded and used to your advantage, and he surely knew that. And I think Toffee, uh, you know, he's had he he's had like a lot of experience with that magic. I think, you know, as the trailer showed us, like he killed. Um, Queen Butterfly's mother, so that's something I'm like, oh, okay. And I really hope that they, they do something of a backstory to it, like a flashback or something like that, um, so that we, we kind of, like, get more emotion out of it, at least, like, and, you know, you can really push the, the, maybe the identities of these characters, like, I mean, like, Especially with Toffee, it's more of the, um, it's more of the cool, suave, and in control, and he knows every move he's gonna make next. Especially like, when he died, you know, I was like, yeah, he he knew he was gonna die, you know, he's like, yeah, he uh, he, he's she'd probably do this, and we saw in the picture that um, someone looking like Star, like it's not really Star, I think it's Star's like ancestor or something like that like she magicked his finger off like she won like she shot his finger off the middle finger i was talking about and i'm like hmm so he he definitely has um he's definitely had experience with the butterflies um so yeah that's something interesting that's gonna be in there like it keeps throwing me off a loop like and i don't know how they're gonna do a season four because like they look like they're gonna wrap a lot up here so I'm not really sure if there's gonna be a season 4 because uh, somebody actually told me there is gonna be a season 4 but I, uh, I, I, haven't re I haven't really looked into it I haven't really seen any news that says yeah okay there's gonna be a season 4 um, but if there is I'm always up for it because you know I hope that they keep going and keep getting bigger and um, yeah okay so this is gonna be a, a movie event, so it's gonna be like one hour plus commercials, I definitely think, you know. So technically without commercials, it's gonna be 30 minutes long, and I definitely think that's okay, like still okay. Like I think my cutoff is 40, so whenever a uh, show is like 40 minutes, I kind of cut it down to 20. Um, and I don't know if I want to cut Star vs. The Force of Evil down, because it's such a big event and I want to... And I'll show you guys my full reaction to it. Uh, so yeah, I'll definitely be there. Um, it's technically the 15th on my end, but you know, since you guys are 12 hours behind, you guys are actually 6 a.m. Now you guys are just 6 a.m. and on the 15th. So, so you know, you usually like the shows would technically be like 8 a.m. or 9 a.m. or you know, usually if it's like more of the live actions, quote unquote, it's usually like 9, 10 p.m. kind of thing. Uh, so yeah, rest assured, I will be there with you guys. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this. And if you did, please leave a like. And if you'd like to see more, hit that subscribe button. And to be notified about more of my videos, please remember to ring the bell because YouTube tells you so. Anyway, guys. Uh, yeah, uh, I don't know when I'll be back, uh, maybe maybe tomorrow, maybe not, because I, I have two more papers left, so uh, just hang in there, um, we, we can get through this together, um, so yeah guys, that's about it, and I will actually be doing uh, a review as well, so stay tuned, um, see you in the next video, see you then.